About a year ago, I sustained a traumatic brain injury and spent a month in the hospital and the first two weeks of that were in an induced coma. When I woke up from that, I was entirely paralyzed. All I had was the movement of my eyes. So I started by relearning how to swallow so that I could eat and relearning how to use my vocal cords so I could speak. Then relearning to use my arms and use my legs and then relearning to walk. Relearning everything, literally everything. I was right where I wanted to be in life. Being one of the best skiers in the world, overly confident in your skiing, overly confident in yourself, like that's where I was. And a freak accident stops that. But I'm not gonna let a freak accident kill my stride. I'm not gonna let it get the best of me. Right now I'm working as hard as I possibly can to return to the sport that nearly killed me last year. Being a professional skier and getting back to what I love has been my motivation the whole time. Yeah! Yeah, buddy! Yeah. Gosh. Thanks and praise to the most high, King Celestia. Yeah, living our life, taking it easy, we're getting there. Okay. Can chase your wildest dreams, swim the ocean shores, sail up into the sky. As simple as it seems, there's so much more. Surely we're giving it a try. Confident in yourself, there's much to accomplish, never fail. There's new lands to explore and new mountain peaks to scale. I know that you can be just anything you want. All you gotta do is work towards it. I know that there's love for each and every one. Now that I'm myself and very fortunate for being that, I want to become the professional skier that I was. I want to become as good at skiing as I was and get better. Only the things you truly love will you pursue with that energy. And for me, my family, my friends, and skiing, that's it for me. That's my life. The joy I get from skiing That's worth dying for. You can chase your wildest dreams, swim the ocean shores, sail up into the sky. Throughout my entire process, no doctor, no therapist, and my parents certainly would never let me give up on anything. And throwing tricks off of cliffs this year didn't come back to me nearly as easy as I thought it would. But it's too easy to give up on the things that are hard to accomplish. So I kept trying, kept trying, and will definitely keep trying until I'm able to accomplish that again. Everything that has come back to me has come back at an exponential rate, so I know it will happen. I'm confident that it will happen. Take a little bit of time. It's going to take a lot of effort, a lot of energy. I'll give it that. I have to. I have to because that's what I want for my life. And what I want with my life, I'm willing to work for. And what I'm willing to work for, I'm definitely going to achieve. Well, stoked. That was so much fun. Back on the shred mesh. That's good, eh? Hell yeah. Super good. Fun times. <laughs>